Kyle Nalowski with the Versailles High School. He's with the uh, golf program, and uh, we got some exciting things to talk about, Kyle. But before we go into golf, uh, wrap us up on basketball because you're one of the assistant coaches with the men's team, and boy, you guys had a heck of a run this year. Yeah, absolutely. Um, it was it was kind of interesting because this is my first year being in high school, and and uh, obviously with Josh being a new head coach, uh, there was a lot of change and there was a lot of uncertainty. And I think what we did as a team was was kind of put a lot of that to rest. Um, we had we had amazing showings out of guys that we knew we wanted to have amazing showings out of. Ryder Williams, Reese Murdoch, obviously. Uh, just came out that Ryder was the uh, conference player of the year. So, you know, obviously great things from him. Reese stepping up, doing what he needs to do. Ty Allison on the defensive end. All of our starters really, really stepping up. And then, of course, you had guys that I think outside the program you don't really hear a lot of. Uh, Xavier and, 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 and Tristan. Uh, coming out and doing things that that uh, don't really show up on the stat sheet a whole lot. Um, Xavier's kind of our kind of our seventh seventh guy in the rotation, and he led the team in charges. Yeah, I mean, wow. that, that's one of those things where you just go, you didn't really have a lot of time to do something that that you know happens only once in a while, and the fact that you led the team in that 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 takes effort, and that's something that we needed. Yeah, so, big, biggest stat in, in basketball, yeah. <laughs> if you will. So you guys lose in the district championship overtime heartbreaker. Mm -hmm against Springfield Catholic, but all in all, a great season, and we're seeing some momentum with your guys' district in Versailles, and so as we transition, you guys have had a really good golf program, won a state championship, I believe, in 94, uh, but now some exciting news for the Versailles golf program. Go ahead and break that for us. Yeah, so uh, this year was our first year having Versailles girls golf. Uh, they're a fall sport. Um, you know, when, when I took over the golf program, I noticed that, uh, you know, from the outside looking in, you never really noticed that uh, it's it's harder for girls to get recruited uh, just because we don't have a girls golf team and and they get they get kind of stuck in the back uh, they're playing from 40 yards uh, difference from where girls who had a girls golf team are playing from but they're not really getting that recognition when they go see scouts and when they go see yeah. things like that uh, so it's a lot harder um, and when I took over my my goal was to give kids as as much of the opportunity that I got um, and so I, I Took that to Kyle Middleton, said, hey, you know, I think this is something that we have a lot of interest in. And credit to him, he's he's probably one of the best athletic directors I've ever met, much less worked with. Uh, and I, I, I can't say enough how much he supported it. And we took it to the board and they, they decided it was something they believed in and wanted to do. Very cool. And you guys, you said in the fall being the first, so uh, would you wrap up with the first season already? And, and yep. how did it go? Yep. Uh, so we we took uh, we ended up with nine girls uh, in total um, that that competed for us. Um, when when we took it to districts, we had a full team, uh, which is something that a lot of first year teams don't have. They have one, two, maybe three kids. Uh, we brought all five and said, you know, this is what we do. Um, and and while it doesn't really show on scores, I think the biggest thing is is understanding what they did as a team. Um, we had girls like. Kiera O'Rourke, who, she's not a golfer, she's a softball player, but she decided this is something that she wanted to do, and, and she became a captain for us and did all those things and, and led that team and kind of built in that mentality of we've got to compete. Yeah. Um, and then and, and the growth that all of those girls showed, we've, we've had girls that shaved pretty much 50 shots off their 18-hole wow. score just because they, they finally understood how to compete and how to, how to get better. Man, um, you can shave 50 shots off of my 18-hole score, and I still wouldn't come close to your 18-hole <laughs> score. Listen, guys, this guy is a golfer. He was a great golfer in high school and has continued to be. Okay, so I want to ask, Kyle, one thing that's new to the Versailles area for girls, and so how do you uh, maybe increase interest for the younger kids who didn't even think about, if you were a young lady, didn't even think about maybe golfing, how do you increase interest? So... Uh, when I was in high, uh, high school and college, we had the uh, Versailles Tiger Golf Camp. It's a week-long thing at Rolling Hills, uh, and I helped run it in high school. And then in college, toward the end of my college career, I decided, you know, I wanted to take that over from Dad. And um, when, when I did that, I had kind of thought about, you know, what Osage and Eldon and those types of schools are doing that are seeing success. And they have PGA-based, for lack of a better term, Little League for golf. Um, so I went to uh, Jason Vansel, who's awesome and, and one, of, one of my idols, and I know probably one of yours too. Yeah. 
and uh, said, hey, you run MCAC, I'd like to run this through you. Um, after about two, two meetings with them, uh, I basically told them, okay, I want to run it through you, but understand if you say no, I'm probably just going to do it on my own. Right. Um, and so we created MCAC Golf. It's, it's uh, run through me and, and the high school team. We have the high schoolers coach them. Wow. And uh, they, they come out and play uh, once or twice a week uh, during the summer. Uh, you know, we kind of floated around baseball so that uh, they can do both. Um, because I, I want them to experience as much sport as possible. Um, but to be able to give them that and, and show them that you can do this forever, that's the thing that I really am passionate about. Very cool, man. Well, I know the boys' season's underway. A couple weeks of practice under your belt. You're leading that charge and a lot going on at Versailles as well. New conference, we talked with Jason Allison and Jason Vansel about that. But all in all, really exciting time for the Morgan County R2 School District. I see you guys just hired a new superintendent. So lots of great things happening, Absolutely. Kyle. I know you're right in there. One of the busiest guys <laughs> in the district. Basketball, you're with uh, men's and women's golf. And then, of course, I know you probably still like to hit the links occasionally. Oh, every leisure. once in a while. Every once in a while. 